In this video, we're going to take a look at a problem that you might run into in plasticity and one way that you can solve it. Keep in mind, this is only one way. There's many ways you can do it, but I wanted to show this because it is something that I've run into and I'm sure somebody else has too. So if we hit control D and we place our center, when we come up here, you'll notice that when we're on a face, it's oriented correctly. That's what we want. But as soon as you snap to a line, it goes to the normal of the line and not the face. So this is a problem. How can we get around this? Well, what we can do is we can draw a line from the center of the cylinder out, hit K for cut, and hit Enter. Now we put a split in the top of that cylinder. So now when we do Control D, we can now place that along that line normal, which is what we want. Because when we come up here, you'll notice now it's oriented correctly. So if we place our cutter where we want them, and keep in mind this cutter can be as com complex as you want it to be. You'll notice here it looks like it's off, but it's really not. It just needs to be oriented correctly on the 90 degrees. But now we have a way to do it because if we hold down control and we rotate it, it's going to snap to what we need, whereas before it wouldn't. So if we go in, we do this, we put everything down. So now we have everything in place. Now what we want to do is we want to hit Q. We're going to select the Q as our target body, and then our tooling bodies, we want to go through and just select each one of those. And then we say, OK, we can hide our curves. And there you have it. Everything oriented correctly. We didn't have any problems, but that's just one way that you can do it. I hope that you found this video useful. And if you did, please hit the like and subscribe. Feel free to leave any comments below if you have any other ways to do it. And I'll try to make some more videos like this showing different problems and how they can be solved in plasticity. Thanks for watching.